I know you and your folks can come down here from God knows where and be about as black as the ace of spades, and as soon as you get here, you start acting white. Mississippi Masala is an interracial, intercultural love story between an Afro-American man who never lived in Africa and a strong-willed young Indian woman who never lived in India. When they meet in a small Mississippi town and fall in love, their families and their cultures clash. But the two lovers find the union exactly to their taste. That's what masala means. It means a mixture of spices. It means like throwing all different kinds of stuff in the pot and uh, hopefully you come up with something that tastes good. Washington's co-star is newcomer Sarita Chudare. The two were encouraged to use improvisation during the filming and Denzel claims that Sarita held her own. Well, Miss Masala, racism, or as they say nowadays, tradition, it's passed down like recipes. Now, the trick is you got to know what to eat and what to leave on your plate. Mm. Yeah. Otherwise, you'll be mad forever. And you'll never eat. And you'll never, <laughs> and you'll never eat. Yeah, yeah, actually, I made that up right there on the spot. And, and she, she came back with a great uh, response. Mississippi Masala is a small-budget film and not a project that would be an obvious choice for a star of Washington stature. When, what one would consider a, a, a proper move for an actor who, you know, won an Academy Award, you're supposed to move up to do, I don't know, Batman Returns or something. But Washington, who just finished playing the title role in Spike Lee's new film, Malcolm X, is known for his commitment to movies of substance. Not all the films I've done have, have a message, but it, I, I do find as I make more films that I, I have to have something to, to sink my teeth into or something that I believe in. For Washington, Mississippi Masala is a movie that fits the bill. He's now hoping that the movie going public will agree. On the Entertainment Beat, Lisa Petrillo, Channel 10, Eyewitness News.